What's up, Chronic Crew? This is going to be a pretty quick video. I just wanted to go ahead and do something kind of a, a little bit shorter for you all. Sorry about the lighting. I didn't feel like setting up the entire setup today um, as it's kind of a pain in the butt for just a quick little like five minute video at max. So if you haven't seen already, this is the calcium acetate that we've created. Um, from calcium carbonate, which is from eggshells. If you haven't seen that already, definitely check out the video I did of how to make your own DIY calcium and magnesium. Now, so many people commented on that video that I didn't mention how to make your own magnesium. And I did, if you listen carefully, at the beginning, magnesium is actually just Epsom salts, and it's just one teaspoon per gallon of Epsom salts. So oops so it's that's pretty much all you need um, and you just use one teaspoon per gallon of this now this is the eggshell mixture as you can see there's a lot of good calcium that's probably stuck inside of all that eggshell so what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a hundred and twenty one a hundred and twenty micron bag and we're gonna sift through um, basically all that eggshell dust stuff and then we're gonna go ahead and jar the actual calcium acetate that we collect so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and you guys are gonna see that process real quick Let's go ahead and begin the process. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and put gloves on because that is vinegar in there. and I don't want my hands smelling for days on end. Now, I do have gloves somewhere. Now, where did I put my gloves? My hands smell like piss. What is this? What is this? Smells like piss. Smells like piss. That's ammonia. <laughs> actually, fun fact, if you do get ammonia on you, vinegar actually helps clear, uh, will help take the smell out. We're gonna go ahead and pour as much of this as we can and try to leave as oh that's what I didn't want to friggin' happen. We'll get somebody to clean that up. We're the ones that gotta clean that up. Damn it, Michael! Good enough for me. Keeping the rest in there. Open this as wide as possible. And we're gonna go ahead and try that a second time. And I uh, hope that second time's a charm and not third time, because I do not want to mess up again. I'm getting all the eggshell slush so I can squeeze it. That is actually important. I do want that. Loud noises! So I'm really trying to clear the bucket. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this. Oh, what in the shit? Wasted some calcium. I'm so mad. So I'm pretty much just squeezed until it's becoming impossible to get any good yield out. Alrighty, I'm back and we are getting gonna go ahead and pour this in it's not the cleanest sifted you could get it cleaner but I don't mind some of the eggshells it does help the soil Wow are we gonna get a full mason jar Ooh. 
Wow, we got a full mason jar. That's so awesome. That'll last my whole grow. So I saved my eggshells, and this is what recycling can do, is it just saved me on calcium and magnesium. We pay about, uh, for a big old bulk bag of uh, uh, Epsom salts, we pay about 12 bucks. So this is your calcium that you, this is calcium acetate. So that's what this is. Happy growing, guys. That's how you collect calcium acetate. <laughs>